I'm Travis Johnson. This is playing you Buzz News. was just sitting here talking about how things have been changing so much here lately and it's that time of the year where everything's changing man we went from an all-out drought couldn't find a duck anywhere and all of a sudden we got the downpours from last week Ralph you must have been praying for rain huh yep well son be more specific next time and tell the Lord we don't want it all in one day that's all your fault Ralph we went from that and now next week we got some uh, cooler weather coming up and now we're gonna go from running the air conditioner to building a fire. I tell you what, you swear we lived in Louisiana or something, huh Ralph? Man, I tell you what, you know, as things have been changing here in our neck of the woods, things in life change too. And when things change, you just gotta kind of roll with it, huh Ralph? Yep. You just roll with it and do the best you can. Hey, when change comes your way, remember this. Old Tracy Lawrence said, the only thing that stays the same is? Everything changes. Everything changes. Hey, y'all remember that. Whatever change yeah. comes your way, we'll just roll with it. And we'll see y'all later. In the great outdoor. Ten years, I see myself in Houston, Texas with five M2s. What I'm going to miss the most is Kelsey. Uh, if I won the lottery, I would move to um, Houston, Texas and buy 10 M2s. If I could go back in time and give my ninth grade self some advice, I would say something I won't miss about high school is uh, homework. And now, Deep Thoughts with Brian Landry. If there is an earthquake on Mars, is it still called an earthquake? This has been Deep Thoughts with Brian Landry. I'm Cheyenne and this is your weather. To start off the week, we have highs in the 70s and lows in the 60s. And with rain comes the first cold front of fall. The rest of the week we can have lows in the 40s and highs in the 60s. We can officially say it is now hoodie weather. Victoria, this is your lunch menu. It's hamburgers with potato rounds. T Tuesday, turkey gravy with cornbread dressing. Wednesday, turkey cheese sandwiches. Thursday, grilled cheese and vegetable soup. Friday, stuffed crust pizza. I'm Alex and this is your sports. Cross country ran regionals last week and we had three top 10 finishers and the boys team was regional runner ups. Zaquan was the individual regional champion. Let's check out the highlights.
Number seven, Caleb Calhoun, Plainview. Number six, Bentley Gidry, Northside Christian. And again, Kendon Markle from Plainview. Good job, Number two, number one, Zaquan Lewis, Plainview. We wish our cross country team as luck as they run a state meet today. Next up is basketball. Both teams have started off the season with a big win. First up, girls team with a big road win over at Hicks. Let's check out some highlights. Let's get it. Stepping on the court, feel the buzz in the air. Green and gold on the opponent's best beware. We hustle hard every game we elevate. From the tip of play, we dominate. Next up is the boys team. After losing their first game of the season to a tough Hicks team on the road, the guys got back to their winning ways with a win over at Bell City at the Fairview Tournament. Let's check out some highlights. From the crossover to the slam dunk, the fence tight, got the rivals in a funk. We grind hard, plus sweat and tears, chasing that glorious reason we're here. Coach got the plan, we execute with skill. United we stand, got the power and the will. No backing down, we face every test. Heart of a champion, we aim for the best. We fly, stinging like a hornet. Under these lights, every moment we own it. Plain new pride, we rise and we shine. Unstoppable force, it's our time. Next up is the Hornet Play of the Week. Cameron Sutton capped off the big win with 24 points and some tough buckets. Let's see how she felt after the win. I'm here with Cameron Sutton, Hornet Play of the Week. Tell us about your big win over Hicks. Um, we came from behind and we fought our way back and we got a good win over a good team. So, Cameron Sutton, Hornet Player of the Week. <laughs> if you want to see your player on the Hornet Play of the Week, please send clips to the email on the screen. Would you rather one million or limited food? One million. Duh. Okay. Would you rather life without music, movies, or life without music? Life without movies. I can't live without my music. Valid. Would you rather be poor but happy or rich but sad? Rich but sad. You know. Yeah. I mean, I'm sad sometimes anyway, so it don't matter. Tragic. Would you rather lose all your eyesight or lose all memories? Lose my eyesight. Memories are core. Period. Would would y'all rather one million or unlimited food? One million. Okay. <laughs> would y'all rather life without movies or life without music? Life movies. without movies. Would you rather be poor but happy or rich but sad? Rich but sad. Rich but sad. <laughs> okay. Would you rather lose all eyesight or lose all memories? Um, lose lose all my eyesight. eyesight. Okay. All right. Would you rather one million or unlimited food? No, I think Dude, one meal, huh? Yeah, yeah. Okay. One meal. <laughs> Five hundred. Uh, would y'all rather life without movies or life without music? Nah, movies. Ah, uh, music. I think my rock way, boy. Yeah, young boy be hitting hard. <laughs> yeah, they gotta get you on. Okay. Uh, would y'all rather be poor but happy or rich but sad? Rich but sad. You can just go buy stuff if you're rich. Yeah. Make you happy. Rich and sad. What, what you sad about? Just go buy something. Would y'all rather lose all your eyesight or lose all memories? Nah, I lose my sight. Yeah. 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 Okay. Would you rather one meal or unlimited food? Unlimited food. Okay. Uh, life without movies or life without music? Life without movies. Uh, would you rather be rich but sad or poor but happy? Honestly, poor but happy. Okay. Would you rather lose all your eyesight or lose all memories? <laughs> lose all my memories because I can make new ones. Okay. okay. Um, one million or unlimited food? Unlimited food. Okay. One million. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Would you, wait, what? You can sell the food. Okay. Entrepreneur over here. Um, would you rather life without movies or life without music? Huh? Life, life, life without, without movies or life without music? Life without music. Okay. No movies. Okay. Uh, would y'all rather be poor but happy or rich but sad? Rich but sad, I can buy ice cream. Okay. Poor but happy, I can get rich. 
Would you rather lose all your eyesight or lose all your memories? All my eyesight. Eyesight. Okay. All right. Would you rather one million or unlimited food? One million what? Dollars. Oh, one million. I'd take a million dollars. All right. <laughs> Would you rather lose all your eyesight or lose all your memories? Oof, eyesight, I guess. Memories, yeah, eyesight. Okay, okay. Live without movies or live without music? Ooh. Ooh, I don't know. Movies, I guess, but I don't know. I love movies. Okay. Would you rather be poor but happy or rich but sad? I am poor but happy. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's a lot. Uh, would you rather one meal or unlimited food? I'm going with unlimited food. Uh, would you rather life without music or life without movies? Life without music. I need my movies. Would you rather be poor but happy or rich but sad? Is there a third option? Can I be happy and rich? Gavin Fee said it, uh, you can uh, buy stuff and that makes you happy. I'll be poor. I'll stay poor. Uh, life, would you rather lose all your eyesight or lose all memories? I'm going to go with eyesight. I want my memories. Okay. Don't forget to like and subscribe.